Last week, Jason gave us an inside look at the Great Falls History Museum as part of a new series focused on rediscovering our own backyard. This week, he hops on the trolley and takes a trip through this streetcar's history. The trolley came to Great Falls in the mid to late 90s. Carol, the trolley lady, brought it to town and she started up with all of the historic tours and using it for different events, um, birthday parties, reunions, stuff like that. Built on a 1981 bus chassis, the trolley is a replica of an 1884 streetcar, very similar to what would have been found right here in downtown Great Falls. It's interesting when you drive down the street, just all the people that just kind of turn and look and then most of them will just get the smile on their face. And, it's, and that's just like awesome. That's one of those, those moments that it's like, okay, you know, they, they're enjoying it just as much as I'm enjoying it. So whether you hop on board just for kicks or to take a tour of the town, there's a good chance you'll discover something new. We try and make it as educational as possible as well as entertaining. COVID or not, the Great Falls trolley is open for business and here to show you around. There's so much in Great Falls. I was born and raised here and I'm still learning stuff. <laughs> it's, uh, it's got a lot of history that just uh, is waiting to be learned. So what better way to rediscover your own backyard than by taking a trip on the historic trolley? In Great Falls, I'm Jason Laird, MTN News. Something else you may not know, it turns out the trolley has a name. Since she's blue and white and the primary driver is a Dodgers fan, her name is Brooklyn.